Um, is this us? Oh, that ain't good. That ain't good. Welcome to Forever Skies. A survival game in early access. Basically, this is Earth. Or was Earth before it was ravaged by a virus. And we've landed on the planet. Well, we've crashed. Not exactly landed on the planet. We have flashing lights. It doesn't look too good. We do have a first aid kit. Let's take the first aid kit. Distress signal. After months of silence, Sagittarius II sent a distress signal and fell silent again. This is our only chance. No one knows what awaits you there. But if there's a chance that they have found a cure, then maybe we could survive. Find the cure at all costs. The fate of us all depends on you. Oh, so no pressure then. You've got to go and find a cure of this virus that's ravished Earth. Looks like. Because we all want to come back to Earth. Of course. All right, let's open the door. Hello? Can we can we open the door, please? Let's try the emergency escape. We arrived at the that worked. Of Return to planet Earth. Investigate the site from which the previous expedition transmitted the rescue signal. I find out if they found a cure for the virus. It's some rickety old bridge we've got to go over. Of course we do. Don't look down. That yeah, looks a very, very long way down. Let's just keep going. Da -da -da, not looking down. Not looking down. Oh God, now I'm coughing. Why am I coughing? Virus activity detected. Health regularly. Virus activity. Oh, yeah. Well, we have health, food, hydration and energy. Got to keep an eye on them. What's around here? Well, you know, there's no, there's no rush. Let's just let's just see what power cord. Let's see what's around here. You know, let's let's scrounge. Who knows? We might need some machine parts and more machine parts and more machine parts. They obviously like their machine parts on this base. Go through the doors or to the left. Let's go to the left. Whatever has happened here, it's it ain't been good. That's for sure. Oh, yeah, a game of machine parts. Oh, nice. What's over here? We're going to use the computer. No, we're not. We're going to power the computer. We're going to find a battery. Let's open these. Maybe there's a battery lying about in one of these. One of these cupboards. No, there's some machine parts. What a surprise. Oh, everything has been screwed up. Screwed up since we went down there. Our immunity is decreasing. We are getting sicker and running out of energy. Our equipment is malfunctioning. And then there's this Noah situation. We should never have sent this expedition. Our place is on the space station. The power blew us again and the door is locked. I'll check if the beacon tower has a compatible battery. It's all gone to hell. I wonder what this Noah situation is. Doesn't sound good. I wonder what Noah's been up to. Water. Let's take some water. We don't need to drink it yet. Let's just take it. Open. No, we can't open. So there's no, no battery here. Oh, we're just going to have to walk up this rickety staircase. Let's not, let's not fall. Why is there holes everywhere? What's around here? It's like something from a greenhouse. The plants are still alive, if nothing else. Oh, well, and this guy's not. I, th I think this guy's dead. Well, very well, does he? Can we zoom in? We can't zoom in. Oh, God. I think we'll leave him alone. Oh, what's over here? Ha, ha, ha. Oh, we've got a spade. Can we, can we take the spade? No, we can't take the spade. Open. We have a battery. Nice, let's go take this battery down. What else we got? Anything around here? No wheelbarrow. So this guy's obviously must have been the gardener. I, 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 I don't know. No, let's go stick this one here. New radio message received. We have a radio message. Oh, well, look. We didn't get the cure. Oh. But we found out that 400 years ago, before the calamity, research was conducted and something was discovered. We came down under the dust and were so close. That's when it all started going to hell. Noah, again, went crazy and started hearing voices. That stole all data, airship, and broke our equipment. He left us to die and fled to his hideout, a greenhouse tower. He's dangerous as all hell. The communication ports are not working. They are blocked by something from within. But we can't determine what. It's as if the world doesn't want to let us send messages. The virus is wrecking havoc on our bodies and we are getting weaker and weaker. The conditions here greatly accelerate its effects. If anyone reads this Reads this, beware, this world is not our home anymore. We are not welcome. Oh, great. You're not kidding. Right, so there's not a lot. We need to get off here. We need to get off here. Is there anything else I'm missing? What's around here? No, I think I think this is it. Right, there was a door over here, wasn't there? Should we go through this door, see where this leads? Oh, machine parts. Oh, <clears throat> the game's telling us something. Oh, we got another first aid kit. Oh. Machine parts. What's this? Oh, oh, somebody's been busy. Oh, food. We don't need to eat that at the moment. We're not hungry. We're fine. We'll keep it. Keep it till we need it. 
Right, let's see what this says. Noah's madness. It's all because of these this damned dust. Noah heard voices. He was mumbling about nature surviving everything, even the fall of the world. That's maybe why the plants in the greenhouse are surviving. He said he knew what to do so we could return to Earth again. He wanted us to help him to follow the voices in his head. Lunatic. We locked him in a cell for his own good. Oh, but they paid the extractor and ran off while everyone was asleep. So this guy wanted to help them, but they thought he was a lunatic and locked him in a cell and then he ran off. Well, he was definitely maybe a little bit crazy. Who knows? I mean, we've got pictures here. I wonder what these mean. I mean, they obviously weren't listening to him. I mean, this has locked him in here. Maybe they should have listened to him. Maybe we'll find more, more about Paul Noah. Oh, God. This rickety staircase. Ooh, ooh. Ah, we found an airship. Good. Maybe it'll get us off here. I don't think we want to drink the dirty water. We could drink, we could take an empty bottle and we can bottle the dirty water. You never know when we might want water. Um, anything else around here? We have a transformer. Makes a change for machine parts. And we, again, are going to read. I've been building a new airship for two months since that bastard Noah got away with our equipment. If only my workshop hadn't collapsed, I would have already had the airship engine research completed. So he's placed the rudder. He's got that far. We, in, we need to place the fabricator, craft the deck extractor, extract the wall blocking the workshop and get the research station. We can do that, she says. Finishing building the, the airship. So... That's the fabricator. That's going to place this on our airship. Where should we put it? Let's stick it there. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. That's fine. Oh, God, look at all these things we can do. Must keep looking around. Down here. Oh, look. I bet you can guess what they are. Oh, we can't get through there, can we? Where do we need to go? What's through here? Oh, just about squeezed. Oh, look. Oh, dear. We can survive. Just take everything. Even if it is machine parts. What's that? Oh, we are running out of food and water supplies. If only we had at least a few pots of these leafy locations, I had to think of another way. I prepared a lure that attracts moths living in the upper layer of dust. Just use it with the insect catcher on the airship. Lower it and wait for prey. The food eaten raw is harmful. I'll leave a membrane for the water condenser just in case some water will be needed to cook the food with the electric cooker. Just remember to, to filter it at first. So this is going to help us find food and I'm to have a, a water membrane. Thank you. More food. We'll take that with us. Beginning to get a little thirsty and hungry, I have to admit. We're going to keep looking around. What else we've got around here? We get under. We can. So we have more, more bottle. Bottles full. There's plenty of water around here though, isn't it? Can we just, can we just fall down? Oh, hang on. <coughs> we're fine. So what's this? This is the insect catcher. Oh, we're going to catch an insect. A moth, they said. Are these the moths that are flying around at the moment? Let's have a look. Let's, let's open it up. Stick the lure in. There we go. Well, let's see if we catch anything. Craft the deck extractor. We need machine parts. Funny that. We've got plenty of them. Printing completed. Okay, where should we put this thing? Well, we can't put it inside. There's not a lot of room out here, is there? Should we stick it here? Just making a wreck it. Raise lure. Well, that ain't a moth. That's a dust lettuce. Eat what's caught. What, telling us to eat it. Do we have to eat it? So looking at this, it'll give us plus five of food and plus five health. Do you know that seven hours is before it goes off? All right. All right. The immune system has dealt with oh, oh, oh. Maybe we, sh we should have cooked it. Now it tells us cooked food is better. Well, it just told us to eat it. Cook food in clean water in electric cooker to improve its nutritional value. It tricked us. We should have we should have cooked it. Extract the obstacle block in the entrance. So I guess we use the extractor to block the Ooh. Ooh. Ooh we get metals. Ooh. Oh, this is fun. What's that? Taking you. Everything that's glowing yellow. Let's shoot. So we're getting like loads of metals from these things? glass from that. Can't we shoot that? We can't. Well, they're giving us synthetics. So these here are giving us synthetics. But these these things sort of floating in the air are giving us synthetics. Good to know. Let's go in here now. We can get in here now. To get the, oh. It is nice of them to leave us all these machine parts. They obviously knew we would need them. Solid state battery. We'll take that. I managed to repair the research station. There are a few old blueprints preserved on the memory card but the most important one is the scanner it is necessary to complete its research and craft it after that it should it should scan certain objects in the world so we can acquire more data for blueprint research i need a battery to run the device i dug out this old power box from the ruins there should be some batteries inside so we look oh 
Is this the research station? Oh, it's massive. Let's, let's just carry this. Luckily, it's not heavy. It's not easy to place, I have to admit. Can we not do small increments? What's toggle snapping? There we go. That's better. Toggle snapping. That's too near fabricator. This thing is massive. I'm gonna like, take up the whole room. Don't like it though. What about here? Perfect. That'll do us. Nice. Right, where's that battery? We need to insert a battery. We have power. Let's go and research the scanner. Now we've got the battery in. We've got everything. We have metals and synthetics. We've got plenty. Scanner. A lot of quick. We've got to, rec we've got to craft the scanner. Now we researched it because craft it. We can. We need synthetics, machine parts, and solid state battery. Brilliant. And we just happen to have them. Printing completed. Analysis completed. Detect new objects requiring scanning. Ooh, what's this? <laughs> a wrecked airship engine makes air fl airship fly. Each engine increases airship speed. That ain't gonna work anymore, is it? That's for sure. Right, what, else, what else can we scan? I don't know anything that's glowing to scan. The synthetic case, a small source of light. Synthetic resources. So yes, when we were extracting stuff from here, we got synthetics. Water contaminated with dust particles, harmful. Drink only in case of extreme necessity. Yeah, we know that. Oh God, it flew away. Come back. Can we scan these things? Nope, I ain't gonna fall off there. Oh, let's get this. Come on, come on, come on. Oh God. Oh no, we're too far away. Get near. Oh, we've done it already. That's what the clicking noise is. So we've scanned that. So we've scanned yes. everything around here. What is? Oh, we need water as well. I got water. We, ha we just happen to have some old canned water, which we can drink. We've got a research engine and fuel. Let's do that over here. Engine and fuel, nice. So I like the little icon, because the icon tells us, look. Whee, we got it. Right, no, that's it. We can't, we can't, we can't swing. Oh, we can swing. No, we can't swing further around. I could, I could do that forever. We could craft an engine. Engine. I suppose crafting an engine does take a long time. There we go. We can, we can add that. I forgot that. We had that. Condense the membrane. Get some more food. Is that still working? That's, that's still doing that. What can we do around here? Let's do a list. Right, we've done all that. Right, we've done all that. We've got to craft an engine, which we're doing. Research station. We've completed this. Oh, food. The engine. We have the engine. Another dust lettuce. Now we know not to eat it. We've got to wait till it's cooked. Where am I going to put this engine? Where are we going to stick it? So, like, here, would you say? Right by the door. That doesn't look very safe, does it? There. There you go. That looks perfect. Maximum there. flight speed increased. Nice. We have an engine. We're going to put fuel. What's oh, doing that? Let's have a, let's, let's have a scanner and see if we can, like, scan stuff around here. Oh, so we're going to see that dead body. Can we scan bodies? Oh, we can. This is Zen Exeran, bless him. He was 47 and he's deceased. Yep, he's definitely deceased. He was a biologist. He comes from a family with a farming past. During the disaster, his ancestors designed and built rooftop farms. On the space station, he was involved in plant breeding. He was also a member of the medical staff. In the expedition, he was responsible for examining biological samples. He was the one who was supposed to create a cure for the virus. Oh dear. Hydration level is decreasing. Well, that didn't go well for him. What else can we... Oh. What's this? Destroyed modeling device. A device used to create and modify models of organisms based on DNA, helpful in finding a creature or plant with certain characteristics. This unit is damaged and will never work again. It is destroyed. It has a destroyed processor and a ripped out data drive. It looks like someone did it on purpose. Noah. I bet, I bet, I bet it was Noah. It's, it's always Noah. What else can we find? Let's go, let's go down here. Oh God. Careful. Careful fits. All right, so, where? Oh, look. Noah's drawings from when he was locked in a cell by his fellow members of the expedition. Humanity, technology, and nature combine and blend together in these paintings. Look, that's a baby, isn't it? Is that a fetus? This is technology, I guess. And this is nature. This one's saying, I don't know what they mean, but they obviously meant something to Noah. All right. Let's go find out about this guy up here. Can we do anything up here? This was Esther Windrose, only 38. It was a navigator. Maps were her life. She studied the plans of the past. She could read much more than for maps than just topography of the land. On the space station, she was a logistic lo logician. She was a logodistian. 
Yeah. She was a logistics. Yeah, she was one of those. She was in charge of creating plans for resource requirements and recycling. On the expedition, her mission was to guide exploration and map areas so far from home. I wonder what she's doing up here and the other guy that was supposed to be dealing with this kind of thing is down there. Didn't go well for them. All right, let's go back to the, the ship. All right, I got the fuel. Let's, re let's do the engine. I, I think we're ready to depart. So we should have something to eat. We do have some food. We picked up old food rations, which won't spoil. Let's eat that for a moment. We, we can. Let's go and get our food up. Let's drink some water. We have another can. Can we cook? Yeah, let's do a electric cooker. Let's close the doors. Like we should. Let's depart. Printing completed. Oh god, look at this. So we got to go. Altitude is. Shift, so that's taking us up. I think. Let's go forward. Mission started. Find a cure for the virus. Send it to the space station. Save humanity. Well, nothing pressing then. All right. We are going out. So all we need to do is basically find a cure and save the planet and save humankind. And we will be doing that in episode two. Thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed.